are you? This is Leslie. channel. So today's video I'm gonna be showing you how to do this makeup look using the subculture uh, palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills and this palette uh, went out like six months ago I think um, and I heard a lot of reviews saying that it has a lot of fallout, that it's not a good palette, um, so many bad things but I decided to try it out and I would definitely say this is not a palette for beginners if you're starting out with makeup this is not the palette to go to. I hope that you really like this video and if you do so don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and if you're not subscribed yet you're more than welcome to do so in the button down below and activate the notifications button. By the time that you're watching this video I'm gonna be already in Boston. If you didn't see my last video I told you guys that I'm gonna be traveling to Boston for an internship that I'm gonna be doing. Um, so if you want to know more about my trip and everything you can follow me on my uh, social media which I'm gonna give the links in the description box if you want to See how it goes over there. And without further ado, let's get into this video. So I'm first gonna start taking this um, mustard color, which is called Edge, and I'm gonna be applying that on my cut crease, and it's gonna be my transition color. I'm gonna be using a fluffy blending brush from BH Cosmetics, and I already applied primer before um, applying the eyeshadows, so that this um, eyeshadows last longer and they. Um, have like better pigmentation. Now with the same brush, I'm gonna be taking the color Fudge, which is this brown color right here, and I'm gonna be applying that on this outer corner on my eye, right under the yellow, so we don't wanna miss that yellow um, transition color that we added. I'm gonna apply it right here. Ooh, this has a lot of pigmentation and I didn't expect it to be like this. Now with the brush that comes with this palette, uh, with the fluffy side, I'm going to be taking this color Destiny, which is like a green, like a military green um, shade. And I'm going to be applying that a little bit over the fudge color that we applied before. And I'm going to be tapping this. So so nice, it's so pigmented. I'm actually very surprised about this shape. I'm just gonna be tapping it, something like this. I'm gonna blend it with my finger. Now I'm going to take this shade right here which is called electric and I'm going to be using the flat side of the brush that comes with the palette and I'm going to apply that from the inner corner of my eye towards the center so it's all this part that we haven't um, touched yet and I'm not using any setting spray or anything like that to bring out the color because I feel like this palette is already very pigmented so I'm just applying it like this Now I want to start building up the shade under my eyes, so I'm going to be taking the same um, shade that we used before, which was the, um, the Fudge and the Dusty, so I'm going to take those two shades and I'm going to apply it right under my eye. I don't want to go all the way to the center, so I'm just applying it like this, on this side right here. Now because I want to try different shades from this palette, I'm going to be taking the shade Adorn, or Adorn, I'm not sure how it's pronounced. But I'm going to take that with my pinky finger and I'm going to tap that in the middle of the two shades that we applied. And it's going to be like a very, like blending everything really nice. So I'm going to be tapping that with my pinky finger. Now I'm going to take my blending brush and blend everything on the top. Now, um... Uh, for under my eye, I'm going to take the same shade Adrian and I'm going to put that here in the middle. Now with the same flat side, I'm going to take this shade right here which is called Untamed. And I'm going to apply that a little bit on the outer corner of my eye, but um, right under. So I'm going to apply it like this. And I'm going to bring it up a little bit. 
So I'm almost done with this um, look. So now I'm gonna take this shade right here, which is called Cube, and I'm using a very, very thin um, brush. And I'm gonna apply that right under my brow bone and a little bit on the inner corner of my eye. And I just want this to highlight, and this is like a very cute shade, it's like pink, I don't know, like translucent, something like that. And like to finish this look, you can just apply mascara and leave it like that. But I'd rather apply some uh, fake lashes since this is, a, this is more like a dramatic look. So I'm gonna go off camera and apply those fake lashes and then I'll show you the final look. And this is how the eyes looks after I apply the uh, fake lashes. And then to finish this, I want to apply this um, lip paint from Tarte. This is on the shade TBT. And this is a matte lip cream, so I'm gonna be applying that. This is one of my favorites lately. I always carry it on my purse and I've used it so so much. So that was it for this video. I hope that you really like it. Um I actually like this palette a lot. Like I said, this is not a palette for beginners. So if you're starting out with makeup, it's a really nice palette. Um, the shades are very, very pigmented. The only thing that I would say is sometimes the, this shade or this one are a little bit hard to work with because of the palette that they have. But overall, I think this is a really nice palette and I love the shades of this. I think it's perfect for like fall season. I hope that you really like this video and if you did so, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and share it with everyone. It really, really helps me a lot. And I hope to see you on my next videos. Thank you so, so much for watching. Bye guys. Love you so much.